How are we doing over there? Okay, it still hurts. Yeah. Let's have a look at that finger. Ow. It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. There we go. Lee? Yes? Yeah. What if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll, uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. We should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? Hmm. I don't know if that constitutes lying. I mean, I suspect her parents won't come home, but I don't actually know that. That's the door to the pharmacy. We should be able to find pills for Larry in there. It's locked. We need to track down the keys if we're gonna help Larry. Huh. There's a photo over there. Huh. Find anything? photo of the family who owned this place. Might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? No. I've been sticking to first names for a reason. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and... Mm -hmm. Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. Because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I don't understand. Just keep it to myself. Thank you. Thanks. Don't worry about it. <sighs> yeah, I know some of those people up there aren't all that reasonable. Uh. Dad kept the remote for that thing in here someplace. The parents came in here hoping to survive. Like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. Man, I'm still being here, Lee, I'm afraid. It's the remote to my dad's TV. Huh, may well be some news. Could use them. That's what I figured. Well, of course. Oh, well. Clementine, you just stay in here, and if anything happens, you just give a holler, all right? Want to head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. I need to find these keys. Lee? Yes? Yeah? You're not bad, right? I, uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? No, he wasn't. Oh. Was he bad? He was. Hey, you two. I'm just looking for the keys. Oh, and an energy bar. Clementine would want that. Hmm. Yep. It's not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. If you need anything else, just say it. Uh, don't need to hog all the- Hey there, uh, this is Glenn, and uh, 
I'm kind of in a jam here. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? Or on the talkie or whatever? This is Lee. What's up? So, I'm down at that motor inn, and, well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I, uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn, we're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, alright? <sighs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. You got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do, somebody's got to. Uh. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. Um, we probably got to find that key first. I would. Don't know if I can just delegate that job to. What are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work though. Here, let me have a look. Yeah, but like that's gonna help. Probably something up behind here. Let's see. Ah. There are no batteries in this thing. What now? You know that there are no batteries in that thing. Yeah, of course. I, I mean, yeah. No. I can try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. No problem. Are the keys here? Didn't he say something about keys behind the counter? We can't let anything happen to Ducky. I know, hon. Did he mean this counter over here? Good me. Okay, let's try. See if there's a... Where the hell is this goddamn key? We just need to get back to Fort Lauderdale. We'll do our damnedest. It's all melted now. Hey, you're hey, okay. Really gave that old man hell. Yeah. We got pushed, you know? You don't have to tell me. I was ready to tear the man's head off. Anyway, we, Cat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. No problem. Is he okay? He's okay. It was just a shock. I got Lucky as hell, nobody got nabbed on the way in here. Yeah. No kid. How's she doing? She's good, I think. She's a tough one right there. She's just a little girl, Ken. What are you saying, Lee? She spent days surviving on her own? That's right. Not just any little girl can do that. What's the plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so... We ought to wait for things to clear up. Sounds good. You said your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? They, uh, own this place. They're, uh, gone. Oh, sweetie. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but, yeah, they're dead. Are you guys all right? Oh, we're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? We've all been through a lot. Yeah. Lee, you got a second? Sure. sure. Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. We didn't even try to save him. That blood is on our hands, you know? It happened pretty fast. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. We can't kill ourselves over We it. killed that boy. We could have saved him together. We did what we could. Bad things happened. We didn't make a choice that killed Sean. You think you do when you look back on it. But in a moment, when things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. You just react. Yes. Try to let it go. That's the best you can do, man. 
You reacted in a panic situation, you just want your boy safe. It's natural. I mean, back when you think back on it, and you ration, try to rationalize it, it may seem like you did something that was disgusting, but... Try to get some rest, Tom. It happens. How can I with those things out there? Oh, hey, is that the... I don't remember them very well. Where's the damn key? No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead guards. Those were coming handy. Oh wait, can I use the photograph on these? Oh, no, it's just this thing out here lighting up. I don't know what I was thinking, sorry. Hmm. Um, anybody? Well, we can fix the radio, so I guess I can do something. Newspaper. Central High Tech State. Paper's a week old. Feels like years. That's how it goes, I guess. This battery should fit the radio. Great, thanks. And I think... And here's another one. Yep. Should be able to get it to work now. I don't know why I didn't just give you both at once. I was just... It's still not working? Yeah, I can't figure it out. Let me have a look at that thing. Go ahead. Alright. See, let's try turning a power on. <sighs> Nothing. Well, if it's turned on the volume is low, then maybe that's why. Maybe she put the batteries in wrong. That's always a possibility. Ah. Yeah, see, here's the problem. At least I think so. I'm not exactly a tech whiz, but I do know my way around a few things. You fixed it. Continues to spread unchecked. The estimated death toll continues to skyrocket. WABE urges you to stay indoors and avoid any contact with individuals you suspect may have been exposed. The station is okay. In the event of a full, uh, my my producer's telling me we have to get off the air. Steve. Uh, WABE wishes you and your loved one. God bless you all. Oh dear. Was it in here, maybe? How is this photograph going to help? That's the door to the pharmacy. We should be able to find pills for Larry in there. Yeah, yeah, but where do we find the key? Hmm. This is just gonna end up with me crawling on all four going ki 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 Come here ki 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 I think it kinda of been I don't remember them very well. Nothing here, no key. <sighs> yeah. Hey, you wouldn't happen to have seen a key, would you? Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. Uh, not right now. All right, let me know if you want to. I'll keep that in mind. Hey, you wouldn't have to seen the keys? You're a pretty good shot. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. <laughs> Radio sign off didn't sound too good. Are you okay? I'm fine. 
You don't have to be. It's dramatic. I'm sure some people got out. Maybe they're all being rescued. Then again, maybe not. Look, do you know where the... How's he doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. Do I happen to have seen the I key? I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. You didn't have to call me a bitch in front of my people. I don't need that shit, alright? It's hard enough to be in charge of people's lives without some dick cutting you down. And that violence before with my dad? That didn't help. What's wrong with him? He's got a heart condition. He takes nitroglycerin tablets pretty regularly. I've seen a few bad attacks that he couldn't get over and needed to go to the hospital. Yeah, that's uh, not really an option right now. I'm just trying to keep him relaxed. He's got a temper. Ah, fuck you! Yeah, he doesn't mean it. It's just that... Yeah? Never mind. I'm sure he's a good guy. He is. He just has his issues. Understandable. Where's her mom? Savannah, I think. Oh. You guys aren't together. Oh, uh, no, I'm not her dad. I found her in a house when getting out of Atlanta. She'd been surviving by herself. Pretty horrible. I think the girl's parents didn't make it. Oh. I heard an answering message. They were in Savannah. She was home with a sitter. It wasn't good. Well, she's lucky to have you. Thank you. I'm gonna get back to him now. Yes, yes. I'm too. I'm still looking for that freaking key. Ugh. Right. You know what? I'm kind of one of those circles right now. I'll get back to you when I find anything. I can't find the freaking thing. Well, I guess I'll look for it next time. It's been a lot of time already, so... This has been Eric Cobra, and this has been Let's Play The Walking Dead Blind. See you all around.